Oh, Stickosaurus here. And today we're gonna start work on a Super Mega Force Green, Go Kaiser Green. Uh, this will be the last one I need to have all of them printed and finished. Uh, maybe, I'm looking at my Go Kai Silver over there and it is a disaster. So we might have to redo that one, but that's a different video. Uh, this is finally finished printing. I think my tubing on my printer started slipping out of the uh, fitting while this was finishing the top. So I've got a little bit of under extrusion here and here and, and the top's kind of not nice. So we can fix that. We'll patch that up. Won't be a big deal. Everything else I, I think turned out nice. Again, didn't take the supports off yet. And the back is actually still printing. So I uh, decided to do this. This is probably my least favorite go Kaiser. Um, but I think he's one of the better Green Rangers. It's just he's in a, a series with literally probably some of the best uh, Super Sentai uh, Rangers there ever has been so far. So I don't think it's his fault. I just think Marvelous and uh, Joe and Luca all outshine him. You name him. Um, A.M. I don't remember how to say her name. I haven't seen Gokai in a while, and I'm still on Goanger for my watch through, so we'll get there. But yeah, let's get started. Okay, so the back of this Super Mega Force Green, Gokai's your green, whatever you prefer. I mean, Gokai's your, of course. But anyway, uh, this broke off when I was taking the supports. And then it broke again when I was trying to take the supports off this part that broke. So we're going to do a three-step process here. This is even pretty dainty, but we're going to attach these parts. Just weld them back on with a soldering iron. I believe it's over here, yeah. So we'll reattach this. This doesn't really matter, but I'm just going to put it in there for somewhere... Stabilit sta stability, 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 found it, don't worry. Um, and we're gonna, well, I'm gonna have to, oh no, maybe we're not adding that part because I dropped it, but I'm gonna add this, tack this, and then we're gonna tack it all to the back. So let's get tacked. Okay, that's our weld in place now. We'll put some epoxy sculpt over this, make it look a little better. It's got quite the striations. Oop, look, that little piece we missed. Yeah, that part doesn't go on the back. That's why we missed it. Trying to smooth this down so it melts together. Again, once we get some epoxy sculpt on there, it'll be fine. Look at this nasty Z seam. I swear I set this to random, but we'll see. Uh, but there's that. We will get rid of these little weird bits in here real quick there we go but we're gonna epoxy sculpt the chin and this little back part and then we will move on to sanding
That's Gokai Green, Super Vanquish Green, sanded. Uh, 60 grit on the filler, and then 100 over the whole helmet. We'll get this dusted off, then we'll move on to filler primer and see what we're working with. Okay, all primed here, gonna dry. Looks like in here it got a little bit of plastic residue still. I got a couple runs. It was a fresh can, so it was coming out a lot quicker. So, it'll be all right. We'll sand that all down. Absolutely no big deal with your first coat of primer. Absolute none. And I think all our uh, patchwork and stuff in here and up here, I think turned out real nice. So, can't even tell those weren't even together at one point which is the plan so let this dry and then we'll move on to some 220. Okay, all sanded. We're gonna put the second coat of primer on here. Gonna be honest, notice this one is sanding. Don't really know what's going on here. Um, it's like the paint came away. I'm not sure, but if the primer doesn't cover that up enough, we'll take care of that. Um, but uh, here we go. Well, sorry, I screwed up and didn't hit play, but we have it uh, all primed here. Again, we'll see what happens over in this area. I went really heavy in there, maybe fill it in. Again, I don't know what's going on, so gonna let this dry, then we'll take a look at it. Okay, we're gonna put the green on this uh, Super Mega Force green. I tried filling this in on this side here like three times and get it to look good and it's just not working. So we're just gonna carry on, see what happens, but uh, yeah. Okay, gonna let that dry and then we'll move on to the gold detailing. Okay, we're gonna do the uh, gold trim on the Super Mega Force green. Uh, can't wait till I'm done doing the Super Mega Force helmets, go Kaiser helmets, whatever. Because I hate masking this part. God, it takes forever. Absolutely forever. But it's worth it. It's worth it. So I keep telling myself, but boy. I have two left to do after this, so. And then if someone ever wants to buy one, I guess I'll do it again. But still, we are getting there. I still got that, that paint cracked on the side again there. I don't know what's going on there. It must have um, under extruded that layer or something, and it's just no infill, so it's just pulling apart. I don't know. I'm real bummed about it, but I don't know how to fix it at this point. I tried three times. Well, I do know how to fix it. I could probably put some epoxy uh, putty on it and 
sand it down and all that, but it just cracked while I was masking it again, so. Kind of late in the game, but it'll be fine. I'm not too worried about it, so let's get going. That should be good. We are going to let this dry, take the masking off, pray we didn't get any uh, overspray or leakage anywhere. It happens. It's disappointing. Not the end of the world. Again, everything is fixable. Mostly. We are going to then do the detail lines and the symbol. I'll probably do with a silver acrylic paint marker. It seems to work best. Um, I think that's what I'll do. I'll, th I'll think about it. That's what I've been doing. And it's been looking pretty good, so I'll probably stick with that and then uh, be almost done. Okay, we're gonna start the detailing on this uh, Gokai Green. I'm not super happy with this helmet. And um, like I said, I've got these weird spots there I tried to fill and just couldn't get them. And the paint's not like super smooth some places. I wouldn't say it's orange peel, it's just maybe I missed it when I was wet sanding, I don't know. But I think it'll be all right, especially once we get everything detailed and then the uh, top coat on. I think she'll be okay. Um, won't be as nice as my Gokai paint that's drying right now. I'm excited about that one, but we'll get detail done on this and then we'll move on to top coat. clear coat on this Gokai Green. Still not super happy about it, but um, oh well. You can't win them all, right? You can't win them all. I'm not having a good paint day, so I probably shouldn't be doing this, but uh, let's give it a whirl. Logo could be a little better. I think I need to order some new uh, black paint markers. The ones I have are getting a little clogged or something. They're just not working as well. So, uh, I think that's going to be my Amazon shopping cart tonight. Another five pack, ten pack. Probably ten pack. But, um, yep, let's get this cleared and see what we're working with. Okay, that's three coats of clear. Uh, we got some runs. I don't know what happened. Maybe I was too close. Um, it was fine when I put the first coat down. I washed it for a minute or two, and then I came back, put the second on. And some bad runs over there. There's a little bit here. The back has one right there. It happens. It happened. I wish I was having a good paint day, so probably shouldn't have. Attempted this, but I'd like to finish it tomorrow. And uh, has to dry overnight before I want to handle handle it. So some places it doesn't seem like it is any gloss. I don't know. It's weird. But uh, all right, gonna let that dry, and then we will add the visor. Magnets and elastic. Okay, okay, okay. Let's put the visor and the magnets and the elastic in this Gokai Green and call it a day. Still not super happy with it. I still think it looks okay. Um, fear makes anything look okay, right? Uh, but this will be the, I got two more. Technically I got one more 
Gokai helmet after this. I actually have a video of all of them. That's interesting. And two Kaisers coming too. Don't you worry, two Kaiser is coming. Um, then again, it's gonna look stupid if two Kaiser comes out before this video. I don't know. I don't really have a plan. I'm working on everything at once. I got like 18 helmets working on right now. I got a couple for customers. It's madness, madness, madness. Shoot videos for all of them, except the customer videos. I don't know if they're okay with that. You know, that's the whole thing. Do another Samurai Rabbit print for somebody, but I haven't heard anything from them, so I don't know if I'm gonna make a video on that or not. We'll see. But that's not important. That's not why we're here. We're gonna put the visor in this. I'm just gonna do the usual. Put some masking paper in there. Trace it. Put it on some PETG that I used spray window tint on. Cut it out. Glue it in. Glue my terrible magnets. I really gotta think of a better way to use magnets. I mean, like I said before, I've. Uh, I tried using like plastic, but sometimes if the helmet's a little too tight, it, it'll like hurt you and you know rub with the foam ones, they don't hurt. I can I don't know who's really wearing all these all the time, but and I still want to get some upholstery foam to put in to make these fit better like around the cheeks, you know. But we'll get there. I know I keep saying that, but it's probably only been three months since the idea popped in my head and every time I'm on Amazon I just forget and because of COVID I really haven't gone anywhere and the only place I could think was Joann's and they used to have like nice coupons you get because I used to make puppets and I used to go and get a upholstery phone there you get a 50% off coupon if not it's like stupid money for a upholstery phone like a, I think they're like six by three sheets or something oh. but I don't know we'll get there let's get this visor going All right, man, those visors make them look pretty. Uh, so I gotta do magnets up, I hate doing magnets. Please, please tell me to find a better way. Now here's some say clasps, two clasps. No, clasps are worse. They hurt and worry me when I'm putting the holes in. I guess you could do it before you're done, but I feel like you're just gonna snap the plastic. Burnt my finger last time. It's it's a thing. I don't I don't like clasps. Do inside clasps. I don't know what they look like. I can't find any pictures of what the Japanese clasps look like. Because apparently there's clasps inside. I don't know. Someone sent me a picture. Are they the same kind of clasps? That seems really hard to get on and off. What is a tight helmet? How do you fit your you know face in there? I don't know. Sorry. Got a little carried away. But uh yep, we're going to I'm gonna make some magnets. And we'll glue this in. Elastic magnets, donezo. Alright, gonna let that dry and then uh, it's time to wrap this up.
that is Go Kai Green finished. Um, I think it turned out nice. Aside from the couple of runs and this weird paint split I had on the side, I tried to fix it. I really did like four times. And every time I thought it was okay, painted something, it just showed up again. So not sure what that was about. I mean, I probably should have welded it and filled it and sanded it, but I didn't realize what it was at the time. I'm still not sure what it was. I don't know if it's the primer. I don't know if it's plastic. It's, it's odd. But um, as you saw in the spin around, it still looks good. I, I'm happy with it. This is technically right now is the last Gokaiger I needed. I do have an old pink I did, but I'm currently working on a new pink. So that video will be coming soon if you want to see that. Um, Gokaiger is my favorite. I'm pretty sure I've said it like 15 times. So it's nice to finally have a whole set. And uh, two Kaisers coming as well. Not really a Gokaiger, but you know, same thing. But love this helmet. Love how it turned out. Um, I hope you enjoyed watching it. It's been a little bit of a journey with this one. Uh, I need to just, the clear keeps running a little bit. I need to work on that. That's something I've been trying to work on for sure. Um, but from here on out, we're just going to get a little better quality for sure. Um, got new stuff in the works, so uh, stay tuned for that. But thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I'll say it again. If there's anything you want to see me make helmet-wise, let me know. and I'll try to make it happen. Um... Bunch of stuff I want to replace that's already up on my wall. I'd like to see your red. He's got to go. He doesn't even have the white around the, the visor. Terrible. Terrible helmet. I'm not even going to show you. You can't see it. So trust me. Uh, when we make that video, I'll let you see it. How bad it is. So we're going to redo that one. Uh, the star um, visor should be a challenge. But we'll see. We'll see how that goes. But that's that's what I'm thinking. I'm playing ahead. Um. Got a lot printing in between there before we get there, but we will. Um, uh, comment, like, subscribe uh, if you want to make sure you get these every week, hopefully. Um, but yeah, hope you enjoyed and uh, thanks for watching.